the Traco are historical partners and the, they have a long history of uh, innovations in the power supply industry. And today uh, we have as a guest, the market manager, Igor Ginsberg. Hello, Igor. Hi. And uh, I hope everyone will enjoy today's uh, presentation and I'm handing over the uh, word to you. So Igor, please, you can start. And uh, if you have any issues, okay. anything, so, just let me know. So I will share my screen. Give me a second. So I hope you see my screen now please confirm yes. it do you see my yeah. screen perfect yeah perfect oh okay in this case we can start at first i would like to thank you to thank sos for this invitation it's very important for us because sos is one of our best distributors in the region and we are always happy and ready to support all your marketing activities also, I would like to thank uh, all our customers who joined this uh, presentation today. And today I would like to show you our new highlights and tell you a little bit uh, uh, about our company, because probably uh, somebody of your customers uh, don't, uh, doesn't know our company. This is why I would like to tell a little bit more about our company, who we are, where we are, and so on. So let's start with our beautiful picture from Switzerland. I came yesterday back. I was there. The weather in Switzerland was nice. And this picture is uh, so idyllic. But why I would like to show you this picture? What is important on this picture? This building is very important for you. It's very important for all end customers because it's our warehouse in Switzerland. Uh, what does it mean? It means that we have more than $20 million invested in our high runners, and uh, these high runners are available directly from Switzerland. You, can, uh, you will get everything just in time. And this is the big difference between us and no-name distributors uh, or no-name manufacturers from Asia, because uh, you it is 100% that you will get everything just in time. Where we are, our head, as I already told you, our head office is in Switzerland, but we have also some subsidiaries. The biggest subsidiary is in Germany with probably 20 employees. We have a design and research center in Ireland. Uh, we have a small subsidiary, it's two and a half men, two employees and one a student in France. Also, we have subsidiaries in uh, USA on the west and on the east coast. We have a representation office in China and we have our production plans in uh, Great China, it's uh, continental China and Taiwan and also in Japan. All these green dots, these are our distribution partners. Few words about uh, Igor Gins book. So I have an academic degree in electrical engineering and business management. I also, I have knowledge in the fields of power electronics and energy technology. So I joined Traco four years ago and I am responsible more or less for the half of the world, I'm responsible for East European countries, for uh, Nordic, for uh, Scandinavia and Baltic countries, for Austria, Turkey, Israel and Japan. Uh, this is why I took this opportunity to join this session today and to tell you a little bit about our company. Uh, but, okay, I told you where we are, I told you who we are, but what are our focuses? Our focus, is, uh, we have our focuses in four uh, markets. The first one, the biggest one, it's an in industrial market. We have a big portfolio for industrial and energy applications. Also, we have a portfolio tra for transportation and railway. 
So I'm talking about ruggedized products for rolling stock and about ACDC power supplies for non-rolling stock. We have a special portfolio for medical health healthcare. All these products have double isolation inside, have a low leakage current and uh, have special certification for basic safety for uh, medical equipment. Also, we have a nice portfolio for building automation systems. All these products have low pow uh, power loses and are ERP ready. If we are talking about toys and consumers, so white wear, it's not our focus market because time to time the uh, end application is cheaper than our converter because we are talking about very simple products. And avionic defense, it's not in our focus because we don't have any dual use applications in our portfolio. And what can we offer you if you are talking about industrial DC DC application? We can offer you everything from one up to 300 uh, watt. Uh, if you are talking about AC DC, we can offer you power supplies from two up to 1000 uh, watt, up to one kV. Uh, we have DIN rail solutions, and for sure we have some customized applications. This is why if you need some something special, please don't hesitate to contact SOS and to contact us. Probably we can design a special uh, power solution for your application. So uh, let's go a little bit deeper. This is our a uh, brochure for the industrial market. We can offer you everything from uh, some replacements for discrete solutions. It's non-isolated, non-regulated DC-DC converter. We have SMD components from one up to 15 watt. We have a SIP, uh, uh, SIP uh, products and uh, with a very high power densi density, uh, for example, with 12 watt in the SIP 8 housing. We have brick solutions for rail, for example, for railway applications. We have chases mount solution and we have some special solutions. Some, uh, for example, this industrial high power DC DC converter for substations. Also, we can offer you some uh, power supplies from Dean Rail solution are up to PCB solution. And you can use it everywhere. You can recognize, you can uh, uh, use it uh, in your production. We have some products for robots. We have some ACDC power supplies for explosive areas and so on and so on and so on. Our portfolio in this case is very, very big. If we are talking about railway solutions, we have everything for rolling stock and non-rolling stock applications. For example, my personal high runner is a TEP with ultra wide input voltage range. Why it's important to have ultra wide input voltage range? At first, you can cover all uh, voltages on the input side from nine up to 100. 60 volt, you can cover everything. You can cover the peaks in the unstable network. And what is important, we have a special pin. I will show you it uh, a little bit later. This is a special solution. Uh, with this solution, you can use the standard capacitors on the input side to cover the gaps in your voltage so in your unstable network also we have some uh, products for air conditioning system for control cabinet and also for example for for the displays you always have some displays on the train station and for this application we have a special uh, power solution and we are quite successful with this if you are talking about medical equipment, we can offer you different power supplies, for example, for lightning system or for this, uh, if I'm, so it's an operation room, but for example, for dentist chair, we have some special power supplies too. Also, we have some DC-DC converters, for example, for this medical equipment, something like THM, and we will talk about uh, this DC-DC uh, converter a little bit later. If we are talking about uh, building application solutions, we have a uh, PCB power supply versions from three up to 60 watt. We have DIN rail power supply solutions up to 240 watt. We have 
open frame power solutions. Also, if you are talking about uh, IoT applications, what's, what is very important, for example, TSA1, you can easily replace some discrete uh, solutions on your PCB, or you can integrate a uh, PCB power supply di directly in your solution. All these products are uh, ERP ready. What does it mean? Uh, these uh, products, they have very low power losses. Where can you find a little bit more information about our products? And uh, for example, uh, you know that you need some uh, DC DC converters, but how can you choose the right one? You can use our application guide. It's available directly on our homepage. Okay, I have the, this button here, but we can uh, send you these links. Uh, you can use uh, the PDF form, and with this PDF form, this is something like a diagram. You can choose the right solution, especially for your application, because it's very easy to understand. Uh, you, you will get a question like, uh, do you have a medical or railway application? Yes or no. In the next step, ACDC or DCDC uh, power level, voltage level, and so on and so on. And at the end, you will get the right product for your application. We have uh, this application guides for four markets, for four industrial or focus markets. And also we have a uh, product finder. It's an uh, engine search engine. It's inter this engine is integrated in our homepage. And with this engine, you can easily find the right product for your application. Probably, if we will have time, I will show you this. So the next step, so I told you about our focus markets. I told you uh, where we are and who we are. And uh, you know our slogan is reliable, available now. And for me, these are not empty words. So we have something behind of the slogan. And what is behind? Reliable. We, we can offer you Swiss quality with our own design and production, with our own technical and commercial support. So we are our uh, trusted distribution channel for sure. And we can offer you know-how. What does it mean for you? We are not affected by any embargo or sanction regulations because we know that some uh, our uh, some end customers in Eastern uh, Europe they were affected because they ordered a lot of components from uh, I I don't want to tell you the name but you I I, I think you know the name of the competitor who was sanctioned by US government. And this is why this, uh, some uh, customers, they got big problems. This is why I would like to tell you, we are not affected. We have our own design. We have our own production. We are from Switzerland. We, we are following all embargo regulations. This is why you will be completely on the safe side if you will decide to buy Traco. We are available. All our high, high runners are on stock in Switzerland, and the lead times are acceptable. And now you can always contact our trusted distribution partner, SOS, and you are uh, always welcome. You can contact us if you have some technical questions. As I already told you, you can do download our declarations and documents from our homepage. These uh, documents are available uh, online. So for example, uh, dual use declaration is available online. You can easily download it from our homepage. Uh, we have uh, confirmations that we are following all embargo regulations. We don't have any businesses with Russia, with Iran or with North Korea. This is why we are on the safe side. And uh, if you need a confirmation, you will get it. As I already told you, this is a screenshot of our homepage. You can download everything, for example, reach city declaration, error, HS compliance, ISO certification, conflict minerals declaration, and so on and so on. You, you don't need to ask us. You can uh, download the, all these documents in PDF.
home directly from our home page. Uh, so now it's time to talk a, li a little bit about our highlights for this year. What is important for arts? Which uh, products are interesting from our point of view and probably from your point of view? If I will summarize this, our focus is on critical safety. We have new high isolated or reinforced isolated products uh, for, with critical functions. What does it mean? These products were designed, for example, for railway and for ruggedized applications. If we are talking about ACDC portfolio, our focus is always on medical, industrial, and encapsulated products. Especially uh, what is important this year, our new UIR series with ultra wide input voltage range. With this series, you can cover everything and we have new cost efficient power supplies in our portfolio. What does it mean for you? You will get a good Swiss quality for less money. And I think it's very interesting. So a few words about our ultra wide input voltage range products. So here's an example of of this product. It's not TEP series, it's THN series in a small housing. Uh, we have different power levels, 10, 15, 20 watt, and uh, we have also 30 watt, but it, it's a uh, high runner. From my point of view, it's a high runner. You can use this product almost everywhere in all applications where with uh, unstable environment. Of uh, This product has uh, ultra wide input voltage range. You can cover everything from nine up to 75 and from 14 up to 160 volt DC. Uh, you can use it uh, in, uh, in, so the temperature range is up to 70 grad degree. We are talking about 15 or 20 watt version, or you can even go up to 80 uh, grad if you, you will choose the 10 watt version. With natural convection, in addition, you can order mm, heat sink. This heat sink could be placed directly on the top of this converter. This uh, product uh, was certified for railway applications. This is why you have here EN 50155. And what is important, this is dedicated hold up capacitor connection. It's an additional uh, pin. And you, with this uh, solution, you can use the standard uh, industrial capacitors on the input side. Because if we are talking about 160 volt DC on the input side and you have unstable network, you should cover the gaps. What is possible to do? you must realize a solution with some capacitors. Capacitors, But if you have one, uh, 160 volt on the input side, you should use big capacitors. What does it mean? These capacitors are expensive because it's uh, not standard industrial uh, 24 volt converters and they're big. So you don't have... Uh, too much uh, space on your PCB. Uh, with this solution, it's possible to use a small and cheap industrial capacitors to cover the gaps because the uh, input voltage cycle will be split. Uh, will be split, and you can use the standard capacitor to cover the gaps in your unstable network. This product is fully encapsulated. You have an uh, isolation between input and output. In this case, we are talking about 3000 volt DC. Also, you can order a uh, product version with a trim function or with a remote on off. All these products have some additional uh, important functions inside. Excuse me like uh, short circuit protection, over voltage protection, or even over temperature protection. And uh, it's a railway product. This is why you will get three years of product warranty. The next highlight uh, for this year, it's a Team 6 
DC DC converter in a DEEP24 housing. This product was designed for medical application. This is why this product has a high isolation up to 5000 volt AC. It was certified for medical application. This is why you have here EEC, uh, IEC 6601. Uh, uh, this uh, um, Standard describes an, uh, uh, it's a basic safety for medical equipment. This product has double isolation inside, uh, low leakage current. It's very important because I had some terrible stories from our customers. They designed a medical application, they integrated some DC DC converters. Uh, but they forgot to calculate in leakage current. And at the end, uh, they made a redesign and choose the right product for medical application. And also, because it's a medical converter, you will get five years product warranty for this product. Some simple but nice products. It's a three watt D industrial DC DC converter all of, uh, with wide input voltage range in SIP8 housing. It's isola isolated. We are talking about 2000 volt DC between input and output. This product has fully regulated outputs. You can use it up to 90 degrees, has a short circuit, uh, circuit protection inside, has a remote on off pin, and because it's an industrial product, you will get three years product warranty. This is very nice product because this product has a very high power density inside. In this case, we are talking about eight watt, but we have a uh, 12 watt in the same housing, in SIP8 housing. This product has an IO isolation, 1,600 volt DC. Is uh, high efficient because we are talking about 86%. Uh, this product can identify short circuit, uh, has a remote on off, different versions you can recognize on the input and on the output side. And for this product, you will get three years product warranty. So now we will switch to ACDC and why it's important, why I would like to show you T our team PV series, and uh, we got some new uh, fa uh, product family members in this series, why it's important for you, because this product is very interesting for different household applications, even for EV charging systems, for secondary c circuit in the EV charging system. Why it is important, you have here, and wide input voltage range up to 305 volt AC. You can cover all peaks in your network, in your household application. Uh, we have different versions, but uh, the housing is uh, chassis uh, mounted. It's, uh, 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 this product has an EN 6335 certification has a high isolation between input and output. We are talking about five kV AC. Uh, you can use it up to uh, 70 grad degrees. This product was designed according to ERP directive. It, have, uh, it has a low, uh, low power loses. And uh, it is, uh, this product has protection class two. So now I would like to show you special product for uh, EV charging systems, because uh, what is important uh, for the EV charging systems, this is OVC3, over voltage class three protection. And this product has this protection. Where can you use it? You can use this product in the uh, secondary uh, power cycle in your EV charging system because you have uh, two uh, cycles, a high current circuit to charge uh, your uh, electrical car and the secondary uh, cycle to supply all uh, this media systems in your car. And for this uh, secondary cycle, it's uh, 
important to have you know, suitable power supply with the OVC3 or certified with OVC3. This product has an a reinforced isolation. You can use it up to 80 grad degrees. It's fanless because we are talking about EV charging application inside of the box. Uh, you can operate it up to 5,000 meters because probably you would like to put your charging system somewhere in uh, Tatra or in Kapati, somewhere there. And for this product, you will get a, pro a three years product warranty. Last but not least, this will be our high runner for this year. So I would like to show you here the TXN series, but we will get TXO series two. What is the difference? So uh, this is only an example with uh, 75 watts, but we will get, uh, or we already have uh, the same power supply with 25 watt or with uh, power even higher than 300 watt. This is only an example here with 75 watt. It's a, a, a power supply in a metal housing with universal input, input with high efficiency up to 86%. And what is interesting, we are, uh, this product is, was, was cost has or ha has a cost optimized design. It's very cost efficient. This is why we are ready to support you with our best offer. And this is why please don't hesitate to contact SOS to get a commercial offer for this power supply system because it's very, very cost efficient. If you would like to have or to get uh, a little bit more information about our products, you can go to our homepage and use our online catalog. What is uh, interesting in this online catalog, you will get an information even about uh, our products which are under development. They are not orderable, for example, this week, but they will be orderable till end of the year. In this case, you will find this information here. For example, TSN2N, it's a new product under development. You will get the technical information and you can prepare yourself. You can uh, download some files for this product to, to make a decision. So this this all from my side. And I think now we can switch to the next step of our webinar. Uh, to the questions and answers. Okay, so um, I enabled the microphone and also the camera for all the attendees. And I can see that we, also, we already have a question in the chat. Um, the question is, AC DC converters really can be supplied. I will open the chat question. Okay. You can just read it out for yourself. Question AC DC converters really can be supplied at DC. If yes, also the power supply ones can be used with DC, which contain PC. So um, please explain me your question because I didn't understand the question. AC DC converter really can be supplied at DC. What does it mean? There is not the documentation uh, on your on your on at the uh, at the power supplies uh, that uh, for example the uh, the type uh, uh, Traco Power X uh, TXL zero fifty or zero sixty series TXL uh, give, give me a second TXL okay. fifty yes for example this is a power supply with 50 watt yes yes and and then uh, the second page uh, input voltage range nominal uh, ac range universal input uh, give me a give me a second okay 
Oh, in data sheet, yes. In data sheet, yes. So the second page in input, yes. Input voltage, uh, voltage range, nominal, right? Uh, AC, DC, the next line. And the third line is DC range. Yes. This is uh, there is written uh, from uh, 100, 125 up to uh, 375 volt DC. Mm -hmm. So, so uh, it, you mean is it possible? Is it possible to use it with as a DC DC? Yes. Yes. Because uh, yes, some of these products they have this function. It's not. Uh, uh, so we didn't made uh, or we didn't make a certification for this function, but of some of these products, they have this possibility, and you can uh, use it as a DC DC two. Mm -hmm. And uh, if they uh, the same uh, the, the next part of the question, uh, when you uh, when you use some bigger uh, bigger power supplies, which contain uh, uh, power fraction uh, corrector. There is also mm -hmm. written that it can be used as a DC DC power supply. And uh, do uh, do they have some special circuit in it, or uh, just it is uh, capable for uh, for some occasional usage? Uh. I can ask our designers from my point of view, it's uh, only comparable, uh, comparable for some usages because it's uh, what we, okay, I, I got, give, give me a second, what, is, what was this? Uh, I can ask our designers, is it a special uh, secret or not? And we can forward you uh, this information. I will make a small, small note. Mm -hmm. Okay. DC DC for for DXL is it some something special right special okay for Mr. Durishek yes okay I will send the answer and probably if it's a special secret probably you will get you know a secret diagram if it's if it's a special secret uh, and I will forward this information to SOS and SOS will forward it to you mm -hmm. because uh, I would like to ask our designers is it special or not I think it's not special as I know but I will ask them mm -hmm. I think so, but uh, but then there's the, there can be uh, can be some some problems uh, at long longer time supply AC DC converters as, uh, uh, as, as a, a DC, DC DC. Okay, it shouldn't be, but I will ask them. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. You are always welcome. Okay, I, I I didn't visit ACDC concert in Bratislava. If it's important, I will answer. I didn't visit ACDC concert in Bratislava, but I visited their concert in Hanover, I don't know, probably seven years ago, and it was great. So, some other questions? I have one question if I can have. Uh, yes, what sure. is usually for, let's say, for 100 uh, watts, con the AC DC converters, what is the, uh, the real lifetime? How many years? For example, for the building, building of automation. You know, it's a very different, uh, difficult question because it, uh, it depends on your environment. It's very important. Yeah. And uh, uh, it depends on the load, yes, because if you will uh, treat your power supply, you will use it, or you know, on the highest power level the whole time, and the temperature is high, 
the life cycle is shorter for sure yes you can calculate it so we are quite open you will get always the mtbf values from our side and you can make a calculation it's always better to if it's a uh, you know uh something like an important application it's always better to make this a lifetime calculation this is why you will get this mtbf value from our side I because it, 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 it's difficult to say is it uh, i don't know how many yes because you know it uh, if you will have always 80 uh 80 grad degree in your application and you need so you bought for example 100 watt power supply and your power is 100 or even higher it's probably mm -hmm. not so healthy for your power supply to have you know to to use it on on the you know highest level of the allowed temperature and power. Mm -hmm. Okay. But uh, you will get this information in our data sheet. The MTBF is always there. I see there are uh, there are a lot of, for example, um, uh, more thousand hundred uh, hours. It means uh, yes, uh, many many years. And yeah, then, yes, uh, but, but uh, you can uh, you have different uh, uh, lifetime calculations. Uh, you have some uh, uh, different methods. I know Siemens method, for example, and you can calculate the lifetime of your application because uh, not only power supply is important for your application. You you should find the weakest chain in your application, and this method allows you to make the right calculation. Mm -hmm because you have different materials in your uh, in your application at all and even in power supply you have electrolytic capacitors and you sh you should calculate all this weakest path okay thank you you are welcome okay and any other dc uh, dc dc no i i know only ac dc uh, so, uh, so DC, DC, it's a cover band, probably. I, I don't know this group. <laughs> okay, some other technical questions regarding our new, for example, probably an, uh, a little bit more interesting information for Mr. Durishek. Uh, uh, I recommend you to order an, a new sample of this TX sensory because if you are using TXL or TXLN it's it will be interesting for you to test the new TXN2 probably it's something for your application okay some other questions so I'm I, I am ready to answer you your questions or to tell you a little bit more about our DC DC or AC DC portfolio. I think there are not any at the moment in case uh, anyone contacts us with uh, something interesting regarding this topic, we will uh, make sure to either forward it to you or other product managers uh, handle the case. So uh, the recording from this webinar will be published on the website, YouTube channels. So also for new track of power uh, publishing, follow the newsletters and social media. I would like to thank you, Igor, for your time and for the detailed presentation today. It was really helpful, interesting, and uh, I'm really sure that it will inspire many of our uh, customers. And um, is there anything else you would like to add uh, by the end? I would like to thank you for this invitation. I would like to thank our cast to it's 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 a pleasure for me to meet our customers at least in digital form and if you have any further questions please don't hesitate to contact us we are always ready to help you we are always here to, okay not 24 hours seven days a week but 
probably 10 hours per day we are ready to supply uh, to support you and to supply you with our know-how sure thank you igor so uh thank you all who joined and i wish you all a successful and pleasant rest of the day bye 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 have a nice day you too thank, thank you, you. Igor. bye